Bohemian Nights is a beautiful gift to the city of Fort Collins. That's just freaking amazing that, that, uh, that we've got that kind of talent coming to town. I definitely think that festivals such as Foco MX and Bohemian Nights at New West Fest, um, they showcase a lot of the talent that we have, you know, in Fort Collins and in Colorado. And I think it exposes, uh, like, our local music scene to a greater audience, like a broader audience, and just the people that go out to the venues on a regular basis. Um, it's more of a special occasion. The, the Foco MX Festival just, just amazed me. It was like almost 400 bands. And that's just, that's not even like Denver and Boulder bands, I think. It's just northern Colorado. There's incredible music in this region, and I think Foco MX is just trying to bring it all together and, and trying to get, you know, get the world to know that this, this is a great, great place for music in this, in this country. I would go as far to say that Foco MX is just at the beginning of a great thing. It's. Um, it's an amazing festival that's run by, you know, a lot of people who are very closely attached to the music scene and I think um, they're generating an interest in Fort Collins, you know, that, that's going to really take us far. I saw 49 different performers in those two nights and that is trekking and I had a great time doing it. I love seeing all the different kinds of music and uh, it can't be much better than that. I don't know that we can get any more music on the street. I think when you when you get to the point where you've got 340 some odd bands playing at 37 venues over three days for Foco MX, I don't know that you could take it any greater than that. I've always seen that as a huge collaboration between everybody who has any involvement in this music scene. It comes together with, you know, it comes together and just puts this whole thing together. I mean, some people, weeks, months out of their lives go into this. It seems like the, the onus of responsibility at that point falls on us as individuals to put things together, to put things together to kind of organize ourselves, you know, to, to get ourselves coordinated in such a way that bands can, can be creative and that it's not shameful to play in front of 50 people. There's nothing shameful about that. Everybody doesn't have to be Pearl Jam. Bohemian Nights, you get this mix of local and national, so it brings everybody out, even the people that are not into the local scene, it gives them a taste of it. It's, it's fantastic. It raises the bar. Makes people want to come here. Makes them uh, proud to be a part of this community. You know, to have a festival of that nature, that professionalism, right in our downtown, is, um, it is a gift, and I think everyone appreciates it. I think everyone gets excited for it. They know when it's coming. Everybody waits for the lineup to be released, and, and the fact that we have so many incredible acts in northern Colorado and Colorado in general, that we can fill all those stages for two days, three days, and then you know share the limelight with a big headliner is, you know, it's, it's, it's an amazing thing. And I think people from different communities are a little jealous of that, and that's okay. Um, you can come over and we'll share it with you. So, lots of great stuff in Fort Collins. Focomex and Bohemian Nights uh, reflects an attitude by the town of Fort Collins, which is, we love live music. We can't handle a summer without live music. We can't handle a spring without live music. We can't handle even a weekend without live music. If you look around town uh, during the summer, we have live music on street corners, we have them on every stage, and it's, uh, uh, so I think these festivals are reflecting everybody's desire to do that. Uh, so I think Fort Collins, above all the other markets in the state, really stands to be recognized nationally as as a very, very unique place. And, and when history writes this story years and years from now, um, you know, people will go, Fort Collins. In Fort Collins, it was my time. All I want is the drums and the bass. That's it.